This episode of the News vs. Food is brought to you by Nick's Family Sports Pub. Nick's Family Sports Pub, home of the 30-inch pizza challenge. Oh my god. Hey, uh, welcome uh, to Nick's. Um, this is the first episode of the News vs. Food. I'm going to come out here and tackle the 30-inch pizza challenge. My name is Greg Waddell. I'm the sports editor for the Murray State News. I'm Eli Phillips, the online editor, and this is uh, Chris Phillips, our art editor. And uh, they've got a 30-inch pizza waiting inside for us that we're gonna we're gonna eat in 30 minutes. Yeah, but let's yeah. go. Yeah. Before we take on the colossal beast of a pizza, I go back to the kitchen to see how the monster is made. This is it. That's 30 inches of pizza right there. I've got to be honest, it, it doesn't seem as uh, as scary as I thought it would. Uh, you wait till it comes out of the oven. Yeah. What's the most pizza you two have eaten? Uh, I'd say I think I've taken a large all by myself. Yeah? What about you? Uh, large. Yeah? yeah. But I mean a large, that's like what? That's like one third of this pizza, yeah? Yeah. So, so three guys. I'd say like a large. Yeah. You'd have to eat a large and a third. Yeah, right. A large and a third per person. Did I hear right? A large and a third per person? I start to cringe as they pile on three pounds of cheese and over a hundred pepperonis. Then they top off the behemoth with fresh tomatoes and red onions and put it into a 585 degree oven for seven minutes. Before we dig in, I'm told that many have attempted this year-old challenge, and only 15 groups have come out victorious. We start the challenge confident, with high hopes, but eventually hit the inevitable wall. Defeat starts to sink in. In the end, only nine unfinishable slices of pizza remain. The timer hit zero, and the pizza claimed three more victims. About four slices in, I was feeling pretty good, and then two slices later, I wasn't. <laughs> and, uh, I was, you kept eating. Yeah, I kept going. It all hit me at once, and it was close to the end. Um, when it hit me, I felt like I was going to pass out. A lot of people have done it. Uh, what did she say? Like 15, 15 groups? 15, 15 since the last summer. 15, 16 have succeeded within, within a year's time, and we came really close. So at the end of this one, I'm not going to say it's an impossible thing to do. Um, but I am going to say it's something I never want to try ever again. Yeah. I'm not going to eat pizza for a while. No. Um, so I guess our first challenge, um, it's uh, food wins. Yeah, food wins. Food won, the news nothing. <laughs> See you guys next time. Thanks.